This video will give you an overview of the key structures of the human brain. This is the front, this is the rear, and these are the two sides. Here is where the brain is connected to the spinal cord that runs through your neck. Taking first the external structure of the brain, this outer layer is known as the cerebral cortex. As you can see, the brain is divided into two halves and has a folded appearance. The folds are mostly only subtly different between one brain and another, and some of them are pretty consistent. Of note is this deep groove, known as the lateral sulcus, or sulci in plural. Another groove, here, is known as the central sulcus. The consistency of the central sulcus and lateral sulcus across human brains help to give rise to the concept of lobes. At the front is the frontal lobe. Below the lateral sulcus is the temporal lobe. This is the parietal lobe. And right at the back is the occipital lobe. Lobes are important because different brain functions can sometimes be associated with particular lobes. Finally, it is important to point out the cerebellum. So far, we've looked at the external structure of the brain, but there is more to explore in the internal structure. As you can see, the folded appearance of the brain comes over into the internal surface that goes down between these two parts of the brain. Important to point out here are the basal ganglia, a group of structures located here, and the thalamus, a small structure located here just above the brainstem.